Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I am here to do my warmer tour. Um, some of my warmers I am not going to show like probably in my bedroom and my office. Um, there's only two warmers in my bedroom and one warmer in my office. The other one doesn't work so I still need to get another one. I don't really turn on those warmers often so yeah. Let's get into it. Um, I am showing you like my living room area. This is across from my couch. So we are close up to the TV and I just have some like fall stuff going. Um, all right, so yeah, you can probably see. Yes, that is a, um, over in the corner there, that is a heater. Um, we live in an old house. This house is from 19. This house was built in 1910. So yes, it is old. So it's not perfect. All right, starting off here, we have my Harry Potter Hedwig warmer um, sitting on top of the books. I love her. She is one of my favorite warmers. My boyfriend got this for me. For Christmas last year he surprised me with this one and the Hogwarts Express um, that one is in my office I don't use it as much because it's only an 8 watt and it doesn't get that hot um, so this one is a 24 watt bulb warmer I love it it has the moon displayed on the thing my lamps in the way but it is what it is it has the moon kind of displayed in the back here and you just take off her head and the wax is melting I just changed my wax so we have um salted pretzel milkshake from that smell good shop in right now in my living room warmers so yeah this is just my tv little table and then I have there's a cat tree <laughs> um we actually made that it's a scratching post so it kind of broke but we gotta fix it but anyway moving on Yes, there is my computer. My boyfriend bought me that. It's like a gaming computer. So I play the Sims in like the um, Hogwarts Legacy game. So this one here is the Hogwarts Castle Warmer. I love it so much. It's one of my favorite warmers. I bought this for myself. I pre-ordered it. I don't remember what year it was, but whenever this came out, I pre-ordered it. And again, we have the wax, but this has the envelope in it. And I love this warmer. Again, it's a 24 watt bulb warmer and it is a favorite of mine. So I always like to display my Harry Potter warmers because they are my favorite. I love Harry Potter. So yeah. All right, let's do, let's pause real quick. All right, moving on to this little corner of my house here. This is, again, in my living room. We have four big windows, so this is the corner of my house here. And um, don't mind some of the, like, indentations on the wall. It's plaster and lath. Like I said, this house was built in 1910, so it's old. It's creaky. It's, you know, the floors creak, but I love it. It gives the house character. Um... Also, our paint job isn't perfect, so don't mind that. <laughs> um, I'm not a professional painter. I do the best I can. So this is, ooh, getting dizzy here. This is where I usually take a lot of my Instagram photos. Um, so yeah, this here, I love it. This is a 24 watt hot plate warmer. I got this on Amazon and it is a I think it was like 15 bucks or something. I don't know. It's an amazing warmer. One of my best performers as well. Um, I know that might bother some people, but it doesn't. Whatever. But yeah, I love this warmer. It's one of my favorites. So um, yeah, there's that. <laughs> I don't know what else to say about it, but it's a great warmer. I'll try to link it down below if I can find it on Amazon um, if you guys are interested like I said 24 watt hot plate and it's amazing it performs so well melts any type of wax so yeah 
All right, so we're in my dining room area right off my living room. Um, this is obviously where I film. Um, yeah, we have yet to finish the flooring while well, the quarter round in this room and in our living room. It's a work in progress. When you buy a house and you do changes to it, you de you'll definitely understand. Or if you have a house and you're changing it, you know, you understand it's time consuming and costly. So, yeah. So this is where I film. I don't obviously have a warmer on my table, but I have a buffet table right across the way here. And I wanna like, I don't wanna show any like pictures or anything because it's like personal stuff. So yeah, here is the buffet table. And again, I'm aiming down to not show photos just for personal reasons. So. This here is a warmer I got this year from Walmart. My boyfriend actually bought it for me. Sorry, I hope I'm not too shaky. Let me see if I could. Yeah, I don't know. I'm doing this on my phone and holding on the tripod. So this is a warmer from this year from Sensationals from Walmart. It was, I want to say, like 15, 20 bucks. I can't remember. But... I love this one. I wish it gave off more of a light though. It only really shines a little bit of light in the back there, as you could tell, um, but it is a inverted warmer. So you lift it up and there it is. I just turned this on so the wax isn't melted yet, but I love this. It gives me like Harry Potter vibes because of, you know, the books and spells and everything like that. So um, this is a 20 watt bulb warmer. So it it's a little um, less of a wattage, obviously, but it still performs really well for me, inverted or not. I don't have any issues with the wax performing or melting. So yeah, I really love it. It's so pretty and I'm really happy to have this one. So yeah, there's that, so okay. All right, so we are in my kitchen right now. Don't mind the little sticker on the light. We are soon hopefully in the coming months be doing our own electric work um yeah i mean my boyfriend's pretty experienced in that so hopefully we get all our electrical changes and um what else was i gonna say that changed in like our what are those electric boxes change so but yeah, <laughs> this is my little coffee bar area, fall coffee bar. I know it's not the greatest, but I like it. So this is a warmer that I've had for a really long time. Ever since I started melting wax, I've had this and I've been melting wax since I was like 17 in my own apartment. So this is old. This is like the original um hot plate warmer from Walmart that is actually 24 watt. They redid this one to make it only 13 watt though and that doesn't perform well in my opinion. I've had, I bought one and I had issues with it so I returned it. Um, so this is the original 24 watt hot plate warmer and again it is old. I am 32 now so it's looking rough but it still does the job it still gets really hot um love it it's one of my favorite performing warmers or my best performing warmers i should say so there is that one along with my little coffee bar station um yeah all right so this area over here is kind of a hot mess it's in my kitchen um just on my counter here because I don't really have many plugs in this kitchen. Again, this house is old from 1910, so it doesn't really have many outlets. So I do the best that I can. So I popped one here that's right next to, next to my gas stove. And there's something on it. Sorry. Again, I'm not perfect. So this one here is, oh gosh, which one is this? I think it's 24 watt. Let me look. 20 watt. This is a 20 watt warmer. This is not the original dish that it came with. The dish that it came with was too thick on the bottom and it didn't get hot enough to melt the wax. So I switched it out with this one and it goes really well. Um, so yeah, this one, this dish is thin enough on the bottom where it gets hot, melts the wax 
fully and pools out really well throw is really well I don't have any issues with this warmer at all so there is that one all right, so next we are moving on to my main bathroom. So this is the bathroom that we just redid from top to bottom. We actually gutted out the whole bathroom completely to where it was like stripped down to absolutely nothing, floor, everything. Um, so we replaced everything in this bathroom. Everything you see here is new. We installed that window ourselves as well because there was not a window in here to begin with and it was just very dark and closety like. So we, I wanted, ever since I moved into this house, a window here <laughs> in this bathroom and I finally got it. So I am very happy with how it turned out. We still got to do some finishing touches, but mainly it's done. And I'm very pleased we did this all ourselves. If I could talk, we did this all ourselves. So I'm very pleased with how it came out. Um, the toilet is actually behind the door here, um, hidden. Yeah, I love it so much. So um, yes, I have a little fake plant. So this is a plug-in wall warmer as you could see this is a 15 watt better homes and gardens warmer from walmart um, it works really well doesn't have any issues melting the wax it gets quite hot for 15 watts so i'm really pleased with it and yeah i i love it i think it goes really well it's like a dark gray with the white tones we got some grays blacks and whites going on in here um outside you could see a truck <laughs> outside the window um that's a work in progress that's my boyfriend's kind of what is it like a work not work truck but like a project truck that's what it is a project truck he loves working on cars so that's why that's out there um but yeah very pleased we did everything ourselves so i'm very pleased with how it looks but yeah, let's move on to the upstairs. All right, so we are upstairs in my second bathroom. Um, this house has two bathrooms. And this shelf is in it because this bathroom is very large. <laughs> and because of the way the wall is angled here, you can't really put a shower. You could probably put a bathtub, but that's a lot of work and we don't want to do that. <laughs> Um, so it just has like sink, toilet, and all this kind of open area here. So I did put this shelf here for now. Um, I do want to paint it white because it doesn't go, but my mom gave it to me for nothing. So I do want to paint it white, but I have some kind of Halloween decorations on it. Like, yeah, so I just turned this warmer on. This I also got from Walmart as well. This is a, I believe, 24 watt. Um, let me look here. If I could see it. Why can't I find it? Oh. It says it's a 17 watt, but it was listed. Oh, that's right. I said that in my video. It's a 17 watt, but it's listed as a 24 watt. This thing gets hot and it melts the wax. So wondering if they labeled it wrong on here because I have two of these. This is one that is in my bedroom and the one downstairs in my coffee bar. That is what I have in my bedroom as well. Um, so yeah, I didn't want to show that for personal reasons, just like my bedroom. Um, but yeah, this is a amazing performing warmer. Works really well, gets really hot. So um there is that one. All right, and last but not least, we have this Walmart warmer. It's 15 watt again from obviously Walmart. Um, works really well, gets really hot, melts the wax, and I like it. It's a really good performer, so if you're looking for a cheap Walmart, you know, cheap wall, <laughs> oh my gosh, cheap warmer, definitely um, check this one out. If you're looking for a plug-in one, this was only seven dollars and same with the iridescent one that i showed you um but yeah there is that 
Alrighty guys, so that is all for my wax warmer tour in my home. Um, like I said, I didn't show you my office warmer because it's just the Hogwarts Express and a warmer that doesn't work. Um, and then the two bedroom warmers I showed you, but not in the bedroom. Um, like I said, I have another iridescent warmer in my bedroom and another one of the older hot plate warmers that I showed you in my coffee bar. So yeah, that is all for my warmer chore. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was like a hot mess. Um, sorry, my home is not perfect, but you know, it's our first home. I love it. We did a lot of changes to it. Um, I feel like no home is perfect, but anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this hot mess of a video. Um, yeah, and I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys.